If you are still bound, how will you travel? I crafted a protection ward that'll keep me from being pulled out of the realm. It should hold until I find what I need. And what is that? The source of the magic that binds me to Midgard. We're going to find it and destroy it. I will help you, but it will not change what I have done. I know. Ain't That's going nowhere without this. Sure. Where would you monk spouts even be without me? And what is it you expect to need Kratos for, Highness? Clearly you've been quite capable of breaking Odin's curses on your own. The other curses grew weak from Thimble Winter, but I still needed help to break them. This one is held strong. So all that trying to kill him, that's just your goddessy way of asking for help? I don't recall asking you to come along. It's cause you did. I got an old drinking buddy I've been meaning to look up once this joint were back on the map. Got a hunch lending you mokes a hand's gonna end me up where I'm going. And what makes you think that? Cause last I heard tell, she was running with that beef wit brother of yours. Freya... ...is not a part of this. Well, my hunch says otherwise. Scroat, too. I can feel the pool of the Binding Curse. Its source is further in. Follow me. Muggier than a Muthelheim shit pit out here. And nearly as fragrant. Suppose Fimble Winter's to blame. But if it helps these two find peace... <laughs> this is a temporary alliance, Mimir. Anything beyond that would require trust. Oh, please. You know damn well Kratos isn't the true cause of your suffering. You're both as much a part of my suffering <laughs> as anyone. Hey! How about a riddle to lighten the mood? What runs with no legs? Easy, a nose. You'll have to try harder than that, bro. Just you wait, smart guy. Come on, let's find a way forward. That's gonna need more magic than we got. Something's wrong. My spell, I can feel it slipping. Well, that's Thimble Winter for you. You don't understand. I'll be torn from the realm. What can be done? Something I was hoping to avoid. <sighs> Seems I don't have much. <sighs> Come on, then. You had a way around Odin's curse this whole time. No. I discovered it once you unlocked realm travel. And it solves very little. This form is extremely limiting. That's Thimble Winter for Do you. Not. <laughs> ah. Watch where you're going. Ah. The plants are extra aggressive in this humidity. Recognize this market. Villages would meet and trade here. Why'd they never rebuild? Brother, do you really think she'll let us off the hook if you help her? I do not know. I choose to help. After that, we will see.
Looks like they sure left behind a lot of goodies. Shame to let them collect dust. That's one way of looking at it. Gone, I wonder. They must have withdrawn, hidden themselves out in the wilds, and covered their tracks with magic. No way of knowing how many are left or how to reach them. Aesir ran cockshot all over this place, huh? You can thank Mimir for that. War with the Vanir was never my idea. My idea was brokering the marriage to end it. A great success that was. Obviously, the peace was no less a disaster than the marriage. Did he invade again, as soon as I was exiled? This here would have made for a prime shop location. Dwarves in Vanaheim? That would be something to see. your brother stirring up an awful scene. Why do you keep bringing him up? My brother is no concern of yours. Do you understand? Oh, I understand plenty.
Plant life grows more dangerous the further we go. Hope you're up for it, dwarf. Listen, I know how bad it can get with one's own kin. Sindri and I were on the out so long, it was like not having a brother at all. Now, I take some of the fall for that on account of me walking out. But it never stopped me blaming him. Oh. Any of this sound familiar so far? And what is your point? My point is, that weren't the end all of things after all. Once we got our heads right, it was like no time in town. He went straight back to being as big a pain in my ass as he ever was. That's family. You gotta keep them close. Where they make you good and crazy. Why do you think I need to hear any of this right now? My focus is on regaining my freedom, and I have no intention of being distracted. Look, all I'm saying is, it happened to find yourself talking to your brother. Maybe the worst words said between you don't have to be the last one said. Enough! When the day comes to face prayer again, it will be when I am standing on my feet and free. Do you understand me? It will not be while I'm stuck in this preposterous situation. Got a case of pride, I get it. Hope yours clears up quick. Couldn't mind you. A touching story, that was. Bite me. You wish. <laughs> What did Odin do to drive everyone away? What weapons did he make the dwarves build? How much was just Mjolnir? Can one man do this much damage? Depends on the weapon and the man. Not now, brother. We've got company. Then you want to keep your insides inside. Yeah. All yours. Big guy. Your people not receiving visitors? I wouldn't know. They're not my people anymore. Come on up. Bet you're glad old rocks around to save you. Uh-oh. Yeah! What? 
We should probably go get him. Keep your guard up. Send another god to do his dirty work. Thor, too busy. We do not serve Odin. <laughs> no? Picked a dangerous place for sightseeing, then. All right. No, no. No need for threats, brother. Oh, I know that voice. <laughs> you know, I'd cut off your head, but it seems somebody beat me to it. Aye. Oh, quite observant, brother. <laughs> no, you're no brother of mine. He sold my sister to that prick. We broke it a piece. Oh. Did you now? Where is it? Hmm? And where is my sister? Some dungeon in Asgard? Is she even alive? Answer me! I guess we'll settle for blood. Stop! What is that? Why do you speak in her voice? It's me, Ingvi. There's no time to explain, just listen. These men are in my service. I'm here to reclaim what's been taken from me. It's too late. You can't undo what's been done. I can. I will. Now let them pass. So, you serve my sister. Oh. Oh. Don't we all? Put him down. What's with leaving me hanging like that? Crusty hag. Oh, can it, lover. Come here. Well, found who I was looking for. Think I'm gonna stay and catch up. Oh, are you now? Do as you wish. Brother, if you wouldn't mind, I'd have a word with Lord Fair. Reminds me of a Vanaheim song I heard long ago. Sorry, we got off on the wrong foot there, stranger. We're pretty used to only seeing Aesir in these parts. Don't typically get friendly faces. That... That is a friendly face, right? His name is Kratos, and no. The Aesir are in Vanaheim. <laughs> yeah, we've been occupied since... Yeah, I lost count. What is your plan? Suka working on it. Mm -hmm. Brother, I think I could be of use here. If my counsel is welcome. I'll take what I can get. 
Your mission will go considerably smoother without me in the mix. Come back for me when you're done. Hey, Kratos, as long as you're working for my sister, carefully you don't screw up. She's not too big on forgiveness. That one, I'm afraid. Now that the distractions are out of the way... I have words, if you would hear them. Speak, then. With anger you feel for your brother. I know it well. Do you have a brother? His name was Demos. When we were boys, he was taken by two gods obsessed with prophecy. The gods of my homeland seldom left survivors, so by the time I learned he had lived, it was too late for amends. His anger poisoned him against me, but I never stopped loving my brother. You think my anger is irrational? You've known Freya for mere moments, and already you're taking his side? I am not taking his... No. You're just sharing your thoughts on a subject you know nothing about. An ancient!
I know what you're doing. Trying to play on my sympathies in the hope I let you live. I am only trying to help. The mistakes of the past need not be repeated. I don't need to hear about your mistakes. I've made enough of my own, thanks. Everyone is so eager to advise me. As if any of you know me or what I need. The biggest loss in my life is due to you saving me when I specifically told you not to. Well, it was my family. My mess. I know Balder wasn't perfect, but he was mine. I know. You know? You think you can even begin to understand the pain of losing a child? Yes. I do. Before Atreus? Her name was Calliope. Calliope? What happened? It was long ago. Never mind. I shouldn't have asked. to attack while their shields are up. Oh! <laughs> 
We need to get to that watchtower. We'll have to go through the valley, this way. I know your son's story. You should know my daughter's. In the service of a cruel god, I was tricked into destroying a village, not knowing my own wife and child were there until their blood stained my hands. I swore revenge. That's... I can't imagine. I paid back their blood a thousand times and burned Olympus to the ground. Yet, the guilt remained. Perhaps you will kill me, Freya, but it will bring you no peace. Perhaps it is not peace I seek. All those times I found you, why'd you refuse to fight me? Every outcome would mean defeat. What does that mean? I have never wished you harm, Freya. You helped us. You saved Atreus when he was sick. I did not wish to live with killing you any more than I wished to die. I see. Oh! You hear that? Noken! And so close to the village! Their song makes their allies invulnerable. They will not let you pass unless you destroy them all. I hardly recognize it. I used to play hide and seek with Freyr in the cross. We'd spend afternoons stealing honey bread from the Grand Hall. At harvest time, we'd dance and feast until the sun rose. It was all so simple. Why did I have to, to be reminded of all this? 